Yeah, that's right. Hi, my name is Cock Nibbler. All my life, I've been an invincible homeless man, just trying to find a way to kill myself. But recently, I found out from three nerd gods that I am destined to complete the main storyline for season six of Skyrim for Pimps. Not too sure what that means, but it's going to take me on great adventures, and who knows what kind of characters I'll meet. This is Skyrim for Pimps, a very special kind of walkthrough. Oh, hey, it's you guys. Hey, let me tell you about all the great things that I've done. This has been so great. I, I became a gladiator, and I, and I killed all these people. I was like, it was like a really manly kind of thing to do. And, uh, you know, I killed that, uh... That, Silence. Or, well, I almost killed that dragon goat nibbler like you guys wanted. I cannot wanted. even begin to express how disappointed we are with you and your performance. What? You have failed in every conceivable way to live up to our expectations. Well, I mean, I did... Shut up! You were given great godlike power for this one singular purpose. Why, well, but I did most of it. I, I sent that, uh... That you just went off and used your power to kill hundreds of innocent people! You're 30 episodes into this season, and you still have somehow not accomplished this task. I, what are episodes? I don't understand. I've I'm already explained this to you. You are a part of a show called Skyrim for Pimps. It was supposed to be wrapped up, you were supposed to accomplish the main storyline, and you failed. Well, I, I pretty you much... You failed in every way imaginable. I'm sorry I've displeased my lords. Just give me five more chances. Nope. You're out. You're done. Goodbye. We rid ourselves of you. Skyrim can fuck off for all we care. It's done. When you say done, is, is that code for one more chance? Uh, whoa! Huh? Whoa! Whoa! Oh. oh, oh wow! Ah, man, oh, you were fucking talking to your stupid gods again, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, they, they, they dragged me up there. Hey, oh, not again! They always do this. This well. is such a rude, rude thing. You, you know, it's weird that water. I swear that water t felt much colder than it usually does. Well, what do they say? At least they have anything good to say. They said I abused my powers, and they were just really pissed off, and. You know, kind of whiny and stuff like that, and so now, I, I, I don't know. I mean, they just kind of like they kicked me to the curb. I don't really know what's going to happen now. I've failed my gods, and 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 that that's the only reason I was put here was to succeed for them and to do the main quest. I'm back on the main quest, starting immediate, effective immediately. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to buy iron armor and iron boots, iron gauntlets, and iron helmet. Just straightforward iron cock. That's me. All right, and an iron sword. Yeah, I need an iron sword too. Can I buy? Can I? Do you have an iron sword? <laughs> he doesn't have an iron sword. I'll check with the other shop owner. Oh yeah, there we go. This is the new me. You look like a nerd. I don't look like a nerd. I look like a a true warrior of Skyrim. Nerd. Totally not a nerd. A nerdic warrior. Shut up! <laughs> look, I even have a sword. Okay. Um, I need a bard. Has anyone seen Brad the Bard? He yeah. was a, he was a pretty good bard. I remember him. Yeah, he used to play here all the time. Have you seen Brad the Bard? It work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. Hey, what, all right, what, retire. Oh wait, this guy, Mikhail. Yeah, if it's a lady you're looking for, you best look elsewhere. Oh, yep, that's that's kind of what I'm looking for. But uh, look at his mouth is too small. Oh god, that mouth is tiny. Yeah, I don't think Mikhail's gonna work. Not for what I need him for. Brad had a big mouth though. What the hell? For Cox eyes only. I'm assuming it's for me. I don't, I don't know anyone else named Cock. I have Brad the Bard. If you want to see his fancy ass again, come to the mysterious cave near Solitude. Oh yeah, the mysterious cave, yep. Uh -huh. Yeah, I know where that is. I know exactly where that is, yep. Prepare for the fight of your pathetic life. <gasps> ha ha! P.S. He screams like a little bee yach. That must be some sort of insect. Mm. He does so kind of sound like an insect. I yeah, mean, it's really high-pitched and nasally in I, voice. I would agree with that. A carriage is the safest way to travel. Oh, I know. Take me to Solitude, or, you know, the mysterious cave. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Okay. Everybody knows where that cave is. Sure they do. Actually, Bajorlam knows where everything is. Solitude's famous for its Bard's College. Worth a visit if you've never been. Some of them can sing just... Wait, no, Bajorlam, please, go on! Damn it. I still, I have to wonder why someone would want to kidnap Brad the Bard. Yeah, that's a really low crime. Bards are just so harmless and gentle. Well, and he's a bit obnoxious, so... <laughs> that too. I kind of feel like they would be the one getting tortured. Yeah. It doesn't really make sense. Oh, here we go. This oh. is it. Here I come, Brad. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You can smell the mystery. It reeks of mystery. Just reeks. Actually, it just kind of reeks. Oh my god. Oh, it smells like somebody hasn't bathed in, like, weeks. Oh, look. A cage. It's Brad. Brad, it's me, Cock. 
What? I'm here to rescue you. Uh, am I dreaming? It's truly me. I found you. I, I've been tortured and hurt. That's true. We'll get you a lawyer, but first let's get you out of here. This cage is unbreakable. Unbreakable? Anything can be broken by the mighty cock. Am I right? Uh, yes, the, the mighty cock can penetrate any barrier. All right. I'm going to break you out of here. Oh, no. Oh, what? The bad man is here. You must leave. Who's that? Oh, cock. You finally made it. So nice to see your smiling face. How do you like what I've done with the place? Oh, by the way, I am Padraig, the unkillable. And unlike mine, your blood is spillable. So now, prepare to die. The time for your death is quite nigh. I am Cog the Magic Hero. I'm sorry my field's not tillable. And I'm also unkillable. What a matchup, what a crash up we'll have. You've cut me, you've burned me, you've tortured me, but it was worth the wait. Mighty Cock Nibbler is here to give you what I got. He'll smash your face, burn your balls, you fucking pussy twat. Smash Poke your, your face, rest, burn your balls, smash your face, you burn your balls. your shit, you fucking twit. For what feels like ages, but is actually an indeterminable amount of time. I've kept this guard trapped in chains, but now the time has come for me to spread the pain. I've tortured you like you've said, and now I'm finally bored and want you dead. But guess what? It won't be easy for you to beat me, you little bitch. Cause I'm actually a motherfucking lich. Say what? So you're undead, not even alive. Guess what? You like a book I will archive. With a sword, with my fist, with the mist. Doesn't matter, you I'll kill you. You will be flatter than a pancake, as they say. I guess they don't really say that, but who cares? Fuck you, you're dead now. Let's go. Come on, bring it on. I'm going to touch you in a way that feels wrong. You're just an overblown skeleton. Now that Cock's here, you'll never be well again. He totally detests you, and now he'll molest you. In spite of your hatred, like a footprint, he'll impress you. You'll walk in the mud with your face. That doesn't make sense. It's a disgraceful lyric. Enough talk, you whore! I got a lunch date at four. Let's start this duel to the death. Yeah! Come at me, bro. You're such a fucking hoe. I'll whip you clean. Your skin will turn green. Can't you see I have no skin, you stupid fucker? I hope your asshole is ready to pucker. Your magic is so weak. But it will turn you into a bloody streak! How does it feel to feel the pain? Losing my health. This is insane. I'm supposed to be invincible. Aha! Nope. Your flesh is mincible. I don't know what happened. The gods must have taken my powers away. Powers away. Looks like you shouldn't have come here today. I'm used to cock not getting hurt. But now his face is in the dirt. What's happening? Why is he not winning? I wish he'd get up and stop his spinning. Go get him! Kill him, cock! What? This door was never locked? Holy shit! I can get out! <laughs> Just kill me now, just kill me now. Go ahead.
ahead and just kill me now. You just suck. kill door. me now. Gonna I gotta die. kill me now. Yeah. Yeah. Well just Go ahead and just kill me now. I'm gonna end be of the cock I as we know mine. it. And I feel <laughs> like <laughs> it of the back. cock as we know it. And I feel fine. So fine. I'm out of here. Out of here. Goodbye. You're next, Brad. Ah! No! Oh, I, I'm alive. I, what? What happened? I, I, I think I killed him. I, I smashed this gem. What is that? That's his phylactery. Phylactery? What is that? A sex toy? Uh, no, it contains his soul. So it's a sex toy that contains his soul. As, as a manner of speaking, yes. Okay. And I smashed it. You did. You. I couldn't leave you, cock. Excellent work. Well, no need to thank me for rescuing you. But I saved you. You were about yes, to... Yes, that's right. Let's head to Whiterun. Good idea. Oh. And I think I have something that I need you to do. Oh, I like being useful. Have you ever seen a dragon up close? Actually, no. Like, really up close. N no, I, I, I haven't even seen one from far away. How wide can you make your mouth? Uh... Never mind. Uh, we'll find out. Pretty wide. All right, Brad, we're gonna head up to talk to the king now. Just be quiet and don't say anything or sing anything or do anything. Your wish is my command. He took a dump with a thump. I said no singing. Sorry. All right, you got the, the BDSM chamber ready? Because I got the bard right here. As I promised, my men stand ready. The great chains are oiled. Oh, yes, you've oiled the chains. This is perfect. <laughs> I can't believe how perfect that is. My men know what to do. Make sure you do your part. Excellent. My, oh, my gods will give me my powers back after this. I know it. Such an, an excellent display of completing the main storyline. Let's go see a dragon. That's right. We're going to see the dragon. <laughs> Start relaxing your throat muscles. Do a little warm up here. I'll, I'll be singing a song. Excellent. Yeah, a song. All right, I'm going to call the dragon. Oh, the bing! All right, get ready. I don't know what direction he's gonna come from. Just don't stand out in the open at all. Dragon time, bitches. You hear that? Just, you probably shouldn't stand out here in the open. I really... Okay, everybody just get back. Yep. Yeah. Okay, what did I just say? This is some serious shit here, people. This is a dragon. Seattle, here I am. Get back here, bitch. Ex-hero of Skyrim right here. I I'm totally weak. Come and kill me. <laughs> oh shit, a trap. <laughs> you idiot. That was so obvious. What is this bullshit? You trapped me and I didn't get to fight me. This is humiliating. Let me guess, you want to know where Goat Nibbler is? Yes, Goat Nibbler. Tell me where he is, or you won't be able to partake of the BDSM chamber. You know, Bard Dick Suck Marathon. What? So I tell you where Goat Nibbler is, and the Bard sucks my massive, scaly dragon wink. Does he have a stretchy mouth? It's very big, you know. Look, you know about the vaunted suckage abilities that bards have. I don't suck. I'm telling you, this bard, he sucks better than all of them. So, what do you say? Asuka na wonky blah. Having a bard suck your dick once is great. But having a bard that's available every weekend to suck your dragon dick is much better. You mean sort of like a booty call bard? Yes, wink in a weekend. Bard booty call. Okay, fine. Send me an Alfred text whenever you need him, uh, and then I'll send him your way. Uh, can I say something here? Shut up, Brad. I'm trying to cut a deal here. All right, but if I'm going to pimp my bard out to you every weekend, how about you take me to the entrance of Salvengard so I can find him? Because I can't fly anymore. My gods took away all my powers, including flying, and it really sucks. Sure, fine, whatever. I can take you there. It's easy. It's called Skull Dolphin. Okay, let me go now. We can get. We can do this. Get the bar. My body is ready. Okay, it's your turn now, Brad. What? All right, I think it's right around here somewhere. Yeah, it's right back there. It's right back. It's right there. Just get under there. I, 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 I don't really want to. Uh, well, you, you don't have a choice. You owe me. I rescued you from your okay. imprisoner. Are you sure there's not something else we could do? On your knees, Bard. Just climb on under. Uh, Tend to fixing your cart. All right, open up. Okay, well, have fun. This is your life now. Here we go. Well, oh. Oh, yes. Doing well, Bard. Keep it up. Oh, yes. <laughs> Keep it up, Bard. Good work. Yes, right there. Oh, yes. 
All right, I'll be back in five hours. You're a good boy. All right, Bart, let's go. Get away from me. Okay, Brad, you all done? I'm back. How did it go, buddy? It was horrid. I, I hope you're happy. How did he fit the whole thing in there? I've always kind of wondered, like, how that would work. Do you know that dragon dicks have spines on them? Uh, don't worry. Um, you'll only have to do it, like, once a week. Kill me. No, I, I can't do that. That would be against the, uh, pimple. Mm. Okay, I have to talk to the dragon now and head out. Thanks a lot, Brad. You suck. All right, I'm ready. Take me to Skeldafin. Yes. Okay, I will. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, here I go. Bye, Brad. Whoa! Cop Nibbler away! Oh, and a dragon! Thank you. Bye. I love He did. He was really good. It was the best head I've ever had. Okay, yep. See you next weekend. Yep, just Alfred text me and let me know. I'll make sure that Brad's there. All right, I can't wait. That is one horny fucking dragon. Yeah, I, I, I wonder if all dragons are like that. Oh boy, oh boy. Now, you know, see, the problem here now is that I just, I don't have much going on anymore. Oh. I'm kind of afraid. What's all that noise? Oh, man. What? Another dragon? Yeah. Uh, this could be a problem. I'm not really, um, not who I used to be. Oh, man. Hey, oh, yeah. Nice. I'm here to complete my destiny. I can still fight. Oh, good job so far. Oh, God. Oh. oh. Whoops, okay. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Apparently you lost your ability to hit with your fucking shouts. Uh, Just kidding, you never had it. This is so hard now, I don't understand. Why have my gods forsaken me? These things really hurt me now more than they used to. Ow, 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 Slash it in the face. Ow, ow, ow. This is a close one. Look at you, you might have to drink a potion. Drink a potion? What's that? It's a, it's a little magical drink that it heals you. A little magical... what? Yeah, it's a, it's a drink that heals you. It's like beer, but it makes your skin wounds close. I, I, I don't have any of those. Oh my god! <laughs> you don't? No. Alright, well, eat... Well, uh, why would I? I've never needed one. You don't have any food either. Oh, man. I have man. a human heart. That's not gonna work. I have some troll fat. Uh, do you know any spells? Uh, wait, excuse there me, dr go. Draugr Scourge. Uh, I've gotta try this out. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah. yeah. Feels Look good. That. Feels good. Feels really good. Uh -oh. Where the fuck uh -oh. are you going, man? Uh, I just fell down a little bit. Uh, now you can't fly either, so... Uh... Man, you have a lot of work ahead of you. I never realized this, but you were only a good hero because you were so invincible. Uh, excuse me? That's simply untrue. You know... you don't know what you're talking about. I was a great hero, and I did the right thing all the time. It just... it just helped me a little bit being invincible. But it wasn't necessary, as you'll soon see. Huh. Well, See? Nice job. I killed a giant golden dragon. Now I'm gonna kill this jerk off. <laughs> I can heal and fight. Haha! -ha. <laughs> Suck it. Oh, oh, I've got a lot of them on my tail here. Uh, this calls for drastic measures. Yeah, none yeah. of you brought an umbrellas, did ya? Yeah, yeah. I might not be invincible, but that doesn't mean I'm not powerful. Uh, can lightning do this quicker, please? <laughs> I'm just gonna go ahead and heal up here. I think the lightning got one of them. All right. Yeah, there it is. Any day now, lightning. Oh, man. This has got to be where Goat Nibbler is. There it is. Portal to Sovngarde. Sovngarde. What the fuck? Oh, man, that's one of the dragon priests. Is it? Not Kreen. Oh, kill well, him. okay, I'll just uh, kill him quick. He seems to have his back turned. He doesn't know I'm here. <laughs> okay, well, that was handy. What's up, bitch? All right, man, you ready for this? You ready to go fulfill your destiny? I am ready. Cool. Wow, the very earth is giving way and leading to somewhere. Should I jump? Yeah, man, go for it. Here I go. Oh! Oh! Hey, guys, Emery and Aaron here. Uh, we just wanted to let you know we're not doing sponsorships really anymore on our channel. You may have noticed that we don't really do those very much. That's because we moved everything over to Patreon. Um, where you can go and pledge like a dollar a month, five bucks a month, whatever amount that you're interested in pledging. That's how we're doing it now, and there's rewards over there that you can get. Yeah, it's really cool when you guys are able to give us donations like that. It helps us keep doing these kinds of videos. It keeps uh, the tacos flowing for Emery. And the pasta. And the pasta. I don't um, want my pasta well to dry up. Keeps the booze flowing for me. And these are all essential ingredients to our comedy. Pay our rent, buy new equipment, 
these are all things that are unfortunate necessities to uh, doing this, and so we appreciate anything that you can give us. I really wish we didn't have to do uh, donations like this, but unfortunately it's just an economic reality of the job that we have. It's just kind of a, you know, YouTube pays a little bit of money, but it's not, you know, it's obviously not enough for us to live on, and so... Uh, that's why we rely on you. So, patreon.com slash gamesocietypimps, and we are glad you're watching, and thank you.